thought about asking me to explain what this thing is. This is a growler for an armature tester. It's used for testing armatures in fields to see if they're good or bad. For example, this one. She's bad. There are a couple of ways, one ways that it will actually test the armature. What I was actually doing is there's an iron core in here with windings on it. And that makes a primary. You put an armature on top. This then acts like a secondary, like a transformer basically. Power gets transferred from one coil to the other. But this here is an open circuit. When they're good, winding starts here on this side. Goes around the iron core, goes out the other side. So when you test it, it doesn't react with the metal strip. But if it's shorted on side, that means the winding is actually connected on both sides. Then mix it a secondary. So it actually mix a current inside the, the armature itself. So power is actually going through this here. Then whenever you put a third piece on top, this acts like a basically a third winding then. And that can actually interact with the AC magnetic current coming onto the armature. So she picks up the AC and gets attra attracted and unattracted to the bad segment. So this one here is bad as well, but this one here actually has a short. The other way you can test it is the actual output. So this will actually be making current inside the armature when she's winding. If you're getting different readings for each segment, that's had heat. There's different resistances inside each of the segments of the armature. Different, different resistances are then going to give you a bad running armature or a bad armature. Numb. Hi. Barely any. Hi. That would give you a bad sign of a bad armature. Third side then. Sign then is going to be a dead short. You'll be looking for a dead short from the commutator bar onto the actual iron core or the metal end of the armature. That'll be a dead short inside. Another fail. Another way that some boys would test it was to actually just switch the thing on and let the armature sit there. And if the armature then gets hot, be a sign that it's gone as well. So, handy wee device for actually testing the armatures. A lot of places would normally have these for testing starter motors and cars. You wouldn't really see a lot of them around nowadays, like, but you still get the odd one. Like. They're a handy wee tool to have lying about. Because time's an armature. You normally get them burnt somewhere, so you can actually visually see that it's gone. But in likes this one here, no real damage on it, but she's dead short, so it's completely gone. But you can really pick that up when you put it on the, the growler. It's a fast way to tell. Stop a lot of messing about rebuilding the motor with a bad armature. Then only to find out in the end it's gone, you have to spend extra money on fixing it again.